Uh, yeah, um, I'm a little bit scared and nervous. Yeah, I can feel the numbness now. She said that it's still a test. It's part of their test if um, the vaccine is working. Yesterday. Early this week, I was in close contact of a colleague who tested positive. Right now, we are heading to Midcare Hospital to get another COVID test. To be honest, I already lost count of how many times I did COVID test. And the annoying part is, it's not for free, and it's very expensive. If I'm going to sum it all, I think I already spent over 20,000 pesos for just a COVID test alone. And the stress level of thinking that your plan will be cancelled because you got tested positive. Or worse, is experiencing all those symptoms and might cost your death. I don't want to die. <sighs> so annoying. The following day. So, uh, hello guys. I just got my COVID test result and for the nth time. Yeah, good thing it's still negative. And uh, now I'm actually heading to uh, get vaccine because guys I'm literally tired this is no good anymore COVID is no joke so I think it's time to end this uh, yeah um, I'm a little bit scared and nervous because I don't know what will be the side effect of the vaccine but So I'm already here at the Dubai World Trade where the vaccination is happening. I'm here at a hall 4 of the Dubai World Trade Center and the queue of getting the vaccine is so long. So these are the conditions written on the waiver that I need to sign. The vaccine that they are giving to the people is the Sinopharm, which is from China. Look, I know what you're thinking, and there's actually a lot of arguments going on. And you might be thinking that I should get the Pfizer one or wait for the Russian vaccine. Both Sinopharm and Pfizer COVID vaccine has been out of the public for now. And it's part for the experiment process to check if the vaccines are effective and they're going to monitor the side effects of it. Both have shown different effects to different people. Some gets feverish, others don't. Both have 
shown positive and negative results. But just a piece of advice, it's really better that you are educated enough before deciding to get a vaccine. Because at the end of the day, it's your body and it's your business. And most importantly, ready yourself. So uh, before they're gonna give you the dose of vaccine, uh, they're going to check your VP if you're feeling okay. Do do I need uh, do I feel some numbness after yes, injecting? You may feel numbness. Like heaviness of the hand. You may okay. Feel. So you will start. I don't show me. Oh yeah, I will not. I will not show you. Yeah, of course. Only the hands. Yes. No worries. Okay. Yeah, I can feel the numbness now. All right. Okay. Oh, I did it! First dose of COVID. So there's still second dose? After what? 21 days. Okay, sure. So I just got my first dose of uh, COVID vaccine. I, I, I can still feel the numbness on my shoulder though. Uh, I hope that there is no vomiting or headache or um, fever that I'll be feeling this evening or tomorrow. Uh, there is a second dose of vaccine uh, 21 days after so it the, the counting of the days will start tomorrow she said that it's still a test it's part of their test if um, the vaccine is working but so far uh, they haven't received any uh, case that has a side effect or worse side effect like um, death or whatever it is so uh, I just hope finger crossed that the vaccine is effective Oh, so I, I got hungry because <laughs> I did not eat my lunch yet. So I got hungry and um, I just want you to know that the COVID-19 vaccine is for free. Um, it is uh, spearheaded by the Dubai Healthcare Authority. So if you want to uh, get your COVID-19 vaccine, you just have to go to the Dubai World Trade Center. Um, hall number four and uh, there's a long queue they're going to hand you a form you just have to, uh, it's a waiver and you just have to sign um, write your Emirates ID number as well as your mobile number and wait for your queue and get vaccinated and then it's done so yeah I'm gonna give you some update on the result if I got any side effects See ya. Bye. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. Bye.